Hey everybody, I've been getting some questions and some messages about how the pool is standing up after a couple of years. So I'm just gonna do a quick video. As you can see, still standing. And this is after two winters here in Massachusetts. Um, so I'll just show you a couple of things that I've noticed. Uh, please excuse the fact that I have not really touched up like the landscaping or anything right now. You can see lots of grass growing through there. Uh, the biggest concern that people have asked about is the fact that I used stones under the legs to hold it up and whether that has caused any rips in the liner. Well, as you can see, so here are the stones that I used on each one of the legs. If you watch my other video, it shows you how I did that, or I talk about how I did it. And uh, the answer is no. The, um, there have been no rips, no tears, no issues whatsoever. Uh, around here on this side, yeah, it's pretty dirty because I've been pulling out the little basket there and just kind of knocking it against the side of the pool. So I'm still in the process of cleaning it. Right here, I can see something has made a home underneath my pool, so I'm a little concerned about that. I'm gonna have to try and figure out what that is and take care of it. Um, one thing that I will definitely have to look at as well is there's some rust so you can see here on the legs. And all around on most of the legs that definitely is some rust. So probably gonna do a little sanding, get a little Rust-Oleum paint, fix that. Um, another thing that I want to do, since it's been up for a couple of years, is these little plastic pop-ins that they use to hold it together. And I'll place those with uh, you know, some bolts so it's a bit more sturdy. Um, the deck is still doing great. Again, one of the videos I talk about how I did this, this whole thing was built for about 500 bucks. Uh, much better alternative than the ones that you buy or the prefab ones. I just wanted something a little bit different. Right now, my water is nice and blue. However, it is milky. You can't see the bottom. So I'm working on that right now. But my cover fell in this winter. So I had, oh, I don't even know. I probably had a half a ton of leaves inside of here. Uh, water was so green it was black it was ugly um, it's only taken me about a week to get it to this point i haven't had a lot of time to work on it so that's the uh, status of where things are right now and uh i'll kind of fill you in let you know what happens here with all the rust and how i fix that but once again this is the coleman 22 by 48 pool. Um, you know, it's basically an Intex pool. They just put the Coleman name on it. And uh, it's been up now going into its third year through the winter and everything. And not a single problem. Thanks, everybody. And uh, please subscribe to my channel if you enjoy these videos. I'm going to make a bunch this summer uh, just about basic pool maintenance and uh, trying to get the most out of your Intex pool. Have a good one.